Each day, the average consumer uses dozens of products. Cleaning wipes, potato chips, coffee, detergent, the list could go on. But they all have one thing in common. They are sold by net content. That could be weight, volume, size, or by count. Weights and measures inspectors make sure those net contents are accurate. Inspectors check packaged goods to ensure they contain the stated net content. Packaging doesn't count and cannot be included in the weight the manufacturer displays on the label. The weight of the packaging is referred to as tear weight. Packaging includes any plastic or paper wrapping and any padding that may be added inside a container. For food products, the general rule is if you can't eat it, don't count it into the weight of the product. A 40-pound bag of fertilizer should weigh slightly over 40 pounds to account for the weight of the bag. Or think of it like going to a deli or cafeteria where you pay for your food by the pound. You would not want that pound to include the weight of the plate or to-go container. At the register, businesses are required to take the tear weight off the purchase, just like companies are required to remove the package weight off their products when they show the net weight. Inspectors perform random checks at retail locations. They determine the package or tear weight and add it to the net weight to get the gross total. The properly labeled product should then yield a positive number when it hits the scale. Inspectors receive their training and follow standards and protocols adopted by the National Conference on Weights and Measures. Inspectors check other products as well, such as tarps and drop cloths and that fertilizer sold by the bag at the hardware store. If the net content does not match the label, a stop sale order can be issued and the product is either properly labeled or sent back to the manufacturer for repackaging. It cannot be sold until the net contents are accurate and the labeling is correct. When consumers buy a product, we want them to be confident the net contents listed on the product are the same as what they receive. This is just one way weights and measures touches your life every day. For more information, contact the National Conference on Weights and Measures at www.ncwm.net or your local Weights and Measures office.